Hello, people of the internet. I'm Solarak Dragon, and welcome back to the Darkest Dungeon, Crimson Curse. Last time, we had a very good start to our first veteran mission. That was not the courtyard. That just went straight downwards. But we've almost got the final boss of the cove, level one, unlocked. So we will be doing this one this time. Um, it's a medium apprentice level mission. Thankfully, already got some of my units picked out in those, and we'll take an antiquarian as well, just because. So, um, let's make sure you are all up to snuff. There you go. And skill-wise, really, you only use two skills. Healing Vapors, getting to that is fine. Whoops. I meant to right left click. You're good, you're good, and you're good because I did just recruit you all. So, let's make sure you got the proper skill set here. Boom. Um, actually, yeah, keep Purge and go, go for the stand. And. You're fine as well. Okay, so the party is all set up. Let's give them some stuff because this is a medium mission. So healing buffs for you, some accuracy, and then some dump, some speed for you. You get some speed and some damage, and you get your candle. And I don't really think I got anything else that would suit you, to be honest, because you're not much of a damage unit. Actually, we should have a Blightstone. Yeah, take a Blightstone. Just so, if you do have to Blight, it's better chances. Alright. Well, our party is set up in that respect. Let's provision up. So, it is a medium, so we want two full stacks of food. Pretty much, we're going to have the same setup as last time, only no blood this time. Because we do not need it. Whoop. Bit too much there. We have two wasting heroes in town. 23 blood. I think they'll be fine. Alright, so, this should be the last cove mission before we get our level 1 siren fight. Um, hopefully we'll be able to do both in one video. Nightmares. They must be flushed out. Two combats initially is not bad. Brigands. Better than what I could have hoped for. Um, nice. Annihilated. Then go for the blight on this one. Two or two damage, and it does one. Nice. Nice number of skills there, game. And a chop chop. Very good. And go for the stud. Because nobody needs healing at the moment. Still, nobody needs healing at the moment. Speed debuff. Oh. Again. It says 2-2 two, two in the damage section, but it only does 1. What's wrong, game? Do you need to learn your numbers again? Size alone does that was nice. Alright. Uh, right, we do have the Antiquary, and we need them to be searching Push all the artifacts, or all the stuff here. Just because we get artifacts from it. Uh, yeah, medicinal herbs. More artifacts, some more food. And moving forwards. Do we get scouting further along? Nope. Okay. Uh who actually has the best disarm chance here? 70, 60, 70, 60. Antiquarian can do it, because if they are slowed, it's not much of a loss. Keep it lit up nice and bright. So the radiant light, good. And we got some core points, but thankfully they are surprised. That will provide some usefulness to us. Uh, I wanted Fester. Um, 
these guys have the little blight resist. It's not much of a blight, but it's better than nothing. It's actually enough that this one is dead now. Destroyed. And go for the kill, actually. Their formation is broken. If we only have one unit to deal with, that's better than multiple. Of course, that one unit does not the Crimson Curse, because that's my frickin' luck. On its own. Of course it would. Kill it. Decimated. It's just my luck. At work. Um, we will actually use the bandage so that we can take the deeds. And yeah. At the very least, we have some blood for this one. You... Of course. Oh, that's... I mean, I would have rather that gone on to somebody else. Curious is the trap and that art. speed debuff is on our Hellion is horrible. Especially considering we got a battle right up here and they're down for 12 freaking rounds. And it's another one of these battles. Yes, target our leper with your blood attacks so that nobody else gets cursed. Please. It's kind of sad that our leper is going first, by the way. I feel like I should mention that. Alright. Uh... He needs to go for the kill. As the fiend falls, I can't have that unit stunlocking us next round. You can go if it bleeds on back. Back is dead. Alright. Yes, attack with your bleed on the unit that's already cursed. No, not that unit. Damn it! Hoping that wouldn't happen. <sighs> Curse is really starting to spread at this point. It's getting annoyingly high levels on our heroes. Thank you for not. Divine comfort. The wounds of war can be top everybody up. But never and finish it off. Um, Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. We'll be fine with this inventory setup. Antiquarian. Nasty gas, you resist. And of course, you go again. You have the creeping cough, which is less damage. You know what? That's fine disease for you, my antiquarian. You can do less damage all you want. That's actually, like, pretty ideal. Abrasive and unnerving. Stress. Lasting impact. Eagle Eye, which is more chance to crit with your range skills, and more courtyard shit. Already half this party is inflicted with the curse. Uh, get that one. For zero. And it resisted both. Q. Um. Smite this one. Or not. Thank you for at least resisting. Barbaric, your is just a stun. Go for the kill. Thank you for resisting the Crimson Curse. Go for it. Rest this advantage. Give them no quarter. Get rid of it, pretty much. And thankfully not yet. Though I imagine it is coming soon. The curse to the other two units that don't have it. Obliterated. 
Okay, that was nice. Um, hit it so it's low enough that the bleed takes care of it. Good. Now it's a four-on-one situation. The one can still curse us, but... Thank you for dodging. Now finish this. Eradicated. Thank you. Another invitation. I don't think we'll need another, to be honest. The amount of invitations we've got right now is probably enough. He says as he gets another one of these fucking fights. Good lord almighty. The courtyard, it wants us. It really, really wants us for some reason. This one is at least dead. And Hugh. This one is dead next round if it lives. Unforgiving. Through this one. Of course you would move. But you are fast, so you should be fine. Confidence that was dead this round because I don't want two curse units. And of course, it does not happen. Thank you. You resist it. You are amazing, Vestal. Um, kill the one that hasn't acted. And chop chop. Or whiff. Whiff, I suppose. Um, that won't kill, so I'd rather go for party heal. For two. Even though you have a plus fifth a plus sixty-three to your healing. If you heal for two. Okay. Um fortifying vapors yourself. And not what I meant to hit. Damn it. Party heal. A momentary Thank you for the critical heal of yourself. Alright. Uh, paintings and rubies. Those rubies already beat out. The ruby, rather, already beats light. out that. And a painting beats out holy water. Sack is empty. Keep it lit and keep going. Finally, some actual cove enemies. It's a shock, I know. Got rid of the stressor. Um, they all have pretty low blight resists. Do as much as I hoped it would. Uh, do we go for the stun or do we go for the kill? We go for the kill. Almost, but not yet. Enough. Ow. Ow. Okay, that's fine. Go ahead and guard him. That's fine by me. Um, you're going to make this one bleed. You are killing this one. Because why not? And then you're just going to chop that one. Because that one has guarded. Ow. Double out because you guys bleeding. Keep them topped up on health. Ouch. Okay, that bleed is really gonna stack up now. So we actually have to focus heal. Good heal. And two and two is four. Not quite enough for a kill yet, but we're gonna do it anyway. Good. And party heal. There we go. Party heal, out heal the bleed that's being done to us. Um, what? This one. Good. Slice it. 
since it's got high protection, it won't go down easy. And chop it. And it's dead next round. Okay. Of course, the bleed is going to continue to stack up because that's what bleed does with this freaking hunger. Frozen, 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 frozen. Fortifying vapors. Get her healed. Nice heal. Um, let's stand. Do some stress relief. For yourself. Go for your stun, because why not? Because it's dead either way. Foolish um, yeah, I don't need any of that. Driven into the mud. Unlock strong box contains anti venom and emeralds. I have nothing low enough value that I'd be willing to drop for the emeralds, so proceed along this path to a big fight. Okay. Yeah, go ahead and eat. We have plenty of food. Uh, the trap is there. It was. Whom was it? That was best suited. There we go. And nothing. It's radiant. Go in here. It is more courtyard enemies. Who would have thunk it? I certainly was not expecting these guys. No siree. I mean, it's not like we fought them more than any other enemy, it seems. Because the game loves them so much. But in all seriousness, this amount of courtyard enemies that we're facing is starting to get a little ridiculous. And of course, you go for your blight and you succeed. And thank you for not booting us. Hard heal. The wounds of war can be healed, but never. I like how both of our cursed enemies have no stress, but every but the other two, who are not cursed, have the stress. It's hilarious. Hysterical, even. All right. These Backtrack time. Can be felt. They can be beaten. Um, probably save our camping until the very last bit. There is still at least one more room battle after all. Since that is our objective, is the 100% of room battles. Haven't been going for too long either, so we should hopefully be able to do the Siren. Not the Siren, but the Sunken Crew fight as well. Provided that it is not a stupidly long dungeon. Already been looted. And good. Of course it Of course it degrades to dim light and it's more courtyard enemies. Well, you held out for like a dozen shots and then you got cursed. I'm impressed by how long you held out to be completely honest. It was only a matter of time. Q. Party heal. Yeah, both of these two have almost no stress, but they have the most damage taken, while the rest of them have almost no damage taken, but ridiculous amount of stress. It's hysterical. And now you are bloated. Elusive exit. He leaves, inflicts horror, and summons a whole new thing of enemies. That ticks me off. So we don't want him to leave. Ever. 
Because now we have three freaking mosquitoes to deal with. Three. Get rid of him, please. Not this round, but next round. That's fine. Iron Swan. Party heal. Keep everybody topped up as best as we can. And Hugh, Hugh, Hugh. Hello. You're the last contestant on. You are dead. Go for your stun. It's useless, but I don't care. I need my units healed. Um, withstand. Get rid of your little bit of stress. And party heal. For two. It's better than nothing. Drop the jade in favor of but the crest. A victory, nonetheless. God damn, that fight was horrible. A nasty gash. No, there is no blood, leper. More scouting. Okay, so this is the last real fight. That's good, at least. Um, no. There is a trap. There is hunger check. That's fine. That's fine, Antiquarian. I don't care that you are slow as fuck. Oh, shit. No clemency in this place. That's unfortunate. Go ahead and take the blood. Because if you are not... If you're in craving mode, then when I do my stress relief after this fight, you would not do it. You would not eat. You would not accept stress relief. You would just cause stress. As is, this one is very bad. Very much bad position. That was some good damage, at least. I was about to say, more stress. Just what I needed. Um, festering vapors. This one. Just in case Iron Swan does not do the job. But it does. Party heal. Okay. These two are pretty much done. You wouldn't work to bleed. You are not yet there. Heal. Ow. You bastard. The curse is getting very much ridiculous, by the way, with how many units I have inflicted with it. Even with the Sanguine Ventures, I can't imagine we're going to be able to sustain this for long. Continue going. Triumphant pride you. precipitates a dizzying fall. Thank you for the stress relief. That's what I was hoping for. And then camp. Circle Feast. in the dark. The battle may yet be won. Good. Now then. Uh Revel. That's fine. And then No. Yes. Pray. And... Can't get rid of the last bit of your stress. Because... 
We can get rid of her stress. The light, the promise of You're safety. You're at 20 stress. I'm fine with you staying on board because that's easy enough to get rid of. Packs laden In fact, with loot. Let's see if we can't lower it a little bit more. Nope. Mechanical hazards possessed by evil intent. Quest complete. At last. Wholesome marine life can flourish. Right. If indeed there is such a thing. So 16k and plenty of stuff. You are still considered selfish, but you are low enough stress that it should be fine to get rid of. Uh, that's bad. That's somewhat sucky. That's eh. That's good. And that's bad. Okay. Do we get an event? I remember no, we do not. The sun get an you're still at the tavern. the tavern. Um, and you are still gambling. Okay. And you are still meditating. Okay. Um, sort by stress. Actually, go in here. Remove everybody here. This will give us the Ancestor's Vintage. List delayed Curse Craving. That's interesting, to be sure. Um, again, I want you to sort by stress. So, you, I need to get rid of that bit of stress. You are fine anyway. That's good. You're going to the brothel. There we go. And yeah, otherwise, stress is fine. Fine. We've only been going for about 27 minutes, so I think that we will be fine to continue and just knock out the um, area. Oh, get the training regimen there. Um, we're 24 paintings off. Uh, can we afford anything in the blacksmith shop? Close. We're nine deeds off. All right. So. Let's set up the party here. Sort by level it already is. One, two, three, and then four. Because I don't think that the Sodden crew can be bled, which is why I'm not taking my Jester. Um, sort by level twice. Uh, they're at the top. Make sure they're good. You're not and you're not either. So, a resilient glaive and fresh leather and furs. Skill-wise, you definitely need stuff. And you're good. You need stuff. And just in case. And then you're fine. Okay. Party is set up. Now we go for these. Uh, equip. Yes. Sort. Johnny's head and the sacred scroll. Uh, you are going to take a damage stone. And was there anything else I wanted you to take? Eldritch Slayer ring, I suppose. You're taking. You can't take a highway. Stop. There we go. You're taking that and that, and you are taking this, and not that, not that, but that. Okay. Party is set up trinket-wise, skills-wise, everything-wise. Let's provision up. Again, another medium mission, so two stacks of food. We want a stack of torches, or a stack of shovels. Two sex torches, three keys, and we do have a Crimson Cursed unit, so we will take along four blood. Let's take off the. Let's take the full six, actually, just in case everybody else gets cursed because that's likely Pride to happen. Eyes have become a nuisance along the old road, and so I undertook to receive my most curious deliveries by way of marine shipments. 
A sheltered jetty was accessible by a narrow stone stair off the back of the manor. And a discreet mm -hmm. system of pulleys could hoist even the heaviest prizes up the rock face from a securely tied dinghy below. Okay. Um. The poor devils. Chained and drowning for eternity. Well, this isn't the boss fight, but we might as well go this way anyways. Because why not? Um, overall, I have no clue where exactly we're going to be heading. The resistance is up. is nice. Okay. Good chance to prove this party is worth. This one needs to die. Because I don't need buffed units on me. Iron Swan. Decimated. Kill. And. Hugh, Hugh, Hugh. Obliterated. Good. Oh. Ow. You resisted. That's what I wanted to see. Uh. Stun. Big guy. Just so he can't guard. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted. The uh, purpose is made clear. Yeah. And you're all on your own, dude. Pick to the face. Should have blighted you, but oh well. Uh, do a party heal. Even though only one needs it. Why not? And chop, chop, Confidence you're on the block. As the enemy or your head is now. Okay. As um, fish idol, evil force. You are less dodgy, but you are more resilient. Funny, funny little combination. Until camping, but we're not gonna camp until before the boss fight. So let's hope you don't need to dodge a lot. And this. Another mariner. Why we brought shovels. Another misfortune. So radiant, and of course more courtyard enemies. Okay. Daggers. Heal. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Bleed it. Dodge it. Crave it. Smite it. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Oh, I will, Ancestor. I will. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. You go for the unit that's already cursed. It's fine by me. You just signed your death notice. Pick to the face. You know what? Party heal. Because why not? And half uh, survival Jesus guide, momentum. better scouting, and trap disarm chance at end. the cost of some speed. It's actually not terrible. Oh, that this is can be used to get rid of debuffs. Huh. I didn't realize that. Learn something new every day. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna be a stressor for the time being, because I'm not giving you blood. Okay. Good surprise around, we can get rid of the map. ASAP. They can bleed. Annihilated. Yeah, he was. And then Q. As gets the rid of the second falls, one. A faint hope and then go for the stun. It missed, but it's expected. And the barrier. That's unfortunate. Though not really, because we can still... Ooh, that's unfortunate, truly. You're gonna need to party heal. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Um... 4 to 8, 9 to 18. Because... Yeah. And then, just hack him. He's dead. Thank you. Give them no Hello. 
Plegic grouper. Goodbye, Plegic grouper. Ooh. Crescendo box. Very rare. Plus two speed, 15% damage, but more stress. Where the heck did you come from? You're new. Never seen you before, but... Um... You won't... I didn't give you a speed trinket. That's why. Um... So... Dismiss head is replaced with that, so you're a little bit faster. And then that goes on to you. Okay. This crescendo box is very interesting. I'm gonna have to look up to see how we got it. Alright, so two treasure rooms ahead. That's fine. Um, drop the Baron's Invitation because we have enough as is. Go ahead and munch. And then uh, you have a 110% chance. I think you're good for it. Keep it lit because we got a battle. Thankfully, it's a plegic battle. Mm, good double dodge. And... Actually, Iron Swan. Nope, not yet. He's nearly there, though. A smite from our Vestal should take it down. We're almost at a half... An, no, we're almost at a 40-minute video right now. I'm trying my best to keep track of time so I don't go too crazy with it. Yeah, you're craving. I know I'm not going to feed you at the moment, though. Good. And you are going for a guard. That's fine. Just means you're going to die a little quicker. In fact... Taste some blighted stuff. Even though that was probably not the best of ideas. Um. Nah, just go for the hat. Not quite. You die from your blight, though, so that's fine. Um. Do a revenge buff on yourself, sure. Never used that before. It gives you more damage and accuracy and crit chance at the cost of dodge and protection. Okay. And party heal. Just tap everybody up. The slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Giving. And throw a dagger for the kill. Oh yeah. Some minor bobbles. This expedition at least chest contains. Goodness. And drop the damage down for the painting. We still have two more, so it's not too big of a loss. Uh, sure. Resilience is heightened further. You have plus 66% resistances. Um, sure, cleanse the carpet kits. That's some good stuff. Um, you could have gotten our medicinal herbs back, but... Meh. We got some sapphires. That's more than worth it. Alright. A uh, bit of more of a stress-focused battle here, because there's two stressors. But, it's not a terrible battle, at least. One down. One to go, stress-wise. Eh. Hew, hew, hew. Two units down. Let's make it a third. Good. The wounds of so now there's just Octocestus. Fun. Never hidden. Which we should be more than capable of dealing with. Ah, uh, picked in the face, rather. Oh, damn, that's good damage. Oh, yeah. Love critting. Alright. Um... Yep, that's fine. That overconfidence is and the key. And insidious killer. Oh, Ancestor, I know. Don't worry, I definitely am keeping that in mind. Um... Yeah, we'll abandon the rest of that. 
Scouting reveals that this is not our boss fight. That's good knowledge to have. Just keep going then. Don't need any bandages. Clear the shipwreck. Keep it decently lit. So, boss fight is over at that edge, which we already knew, but confirming it is its own reward. So, we have to think of where it is exactly. Hopefully we get some scouting done so that that completely solidifies where it is, but if we don't, then we're going to have to take a guess. So I do want to get a scouting in before we do the boss fight, because this one is actually fairly decently difficult. Um, yeah, shipwreck, get cleared. So it's either here or here, I think. Could actually be in either of those locations, in any of those three upper locations, to be honest. Which is what worries me. Still some booty. Got more paintings, that's good. A map. That is excellent. Oh, you little son of a biscuit. You would cut off just before actually reaching the rooms. You would, game. Tempting me like that. And courtyard. Enemies. Okay. Daggers. Enraging Slight is move. Our leper is now useless. Um. Damn it. Did I kill back? Yeah, this is a bad turn of events right now. Uh, we have to... Damn it! Not even a kill on the first round. And... Thankfully no curse there. You resisted it, that's why. We need to try and kill this dude. Not quite... We need to go for that kill. I don't need him summoning more things and causing a mass stress out. Like she just did. Ah, uh, smite this one. Well struck. Incredibly well struck, luckily. And then heal. Yeah. Get rid of the corpses. Bring it up close and personal. Pre-digestion is kind of disgusting. But you get used to it after a little time, and it's done. Uh, some blood. You know what? Because I don't want that inventory space taken up. There we go. And go ahead and munch. Eerie Coral is soothing to the mind. Thank you for the little bit of stress relief. That's what I was hoping to get. It well lit. Six torches remain. No scouting. Shit. Let's go the way that doesn't have the battle. A map. Oh, yes. Okay, the boss fight is right there. Good to know. Um, we can camp out in this room, then. Yeah, we can camp out in this room. Uh, of course we crit the one that I wanted to not crit. I would rather have crit that one. Back to the Get rid of the stunners. That's not stun attack, it's bleed. Which is not bad, to be honest. And then it hew. Kill him, that's good. And... Honestly, we don't need to party heal. Go for the kill because we're going to be healing up when we can. And then, finish it. Another one falls. 
Another one bites the dust. Ah. These nightmarish um, creatures can be yeah. filled. They can be beaten. And then camp. A spark Feast. Everybody is Sigur fully healed. You're the only one with a bit of stress. Um Let's prevent a nighttime ambush. And then deal with his stress a little bit. Alright, now then. We need to buff ourselves. It's a one companion stress reduction. Uh, yeah, battle trance and sharpen your spear because you are going to be locked into first position here. The match is struck. A blazing star Treasures is born. hidden inside. Some gold. Okay. So since the sunken crew likes to lock down whoever's in first position to first position, that's why I'm having her Finding maintain first position first with all those level now buffs. Be carried home. Okay. I'll keep it lit. Even in and here's the Sodom crew. Sodom crew this time. And the all hands on deck. Obeys. Is their summon of their dude here. Alright. Uh, they have not terrible bleep resist. Iron Swan has same accuracy and crit chance, so just attack. And then throw the dagger. Q. Boarding clutch. It's a bleed. And let's see if we can't get a stun off on this guy. Nope. Drink with the dead. It's a stress attack. Oh, shut up. Heave to. Heals him. Locks her in place. And actually heals him. And it does work. Really well. Uh, just attack. You heal every turn, though, so that's a little annoying. You only heal for three, so we out damage it. That's fine. Uh, thank you. That's not what I was gonna have you do, though. Shit. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. You almost killed him close. Mutiny. I don't want to know what that would have done. That's clearly a debuff of some sort. Nice crit. Stress is starting to add up on our Hellion. Uh, go for the kill there. Just so it has to waste its turn with summoning another unit. Nice hit for 23. Stressor. And just chop now. Good damage. It's nearly dead. Missed. And it's gonna summon its dude. That's fine. Throw a dagger. It's at 4 health. We the should have this. Quickens. Finish it. Are you gonna stay alive? Nope. Um, we'll take both. Why not? Uh, there's no more things for shovels, so we'll drop that. And we're gonna keep going because there's one more room battle. And it's a treasure room, so why not? If only crests, treasure could stop. Uh, Otherworldly corruption. We're fine. Keep it lit. Of course, it's more crimson curse enemies before that. She's gonna need some serious stress relief. You should finish you off. Um, we're actually going to Iron Swan. And then heal. Not quite a kill there, but close. And 
man. You bat. You bitch. Accuracy debuff. That's... Demonic. I was... Gonna panic there for a moment. I was seriously thinking we were gonna get cursed in penultimate battle of this mission. Her stress is getting very high up there. It's actually tempting me to not continue. But a victory nonetheless. But we're almost there, so we gotta keep going. We just gotta push forwards through the task at hand. And do this last battle, which is thankfully not more cursed enemies, but there is two stressors, so kill them first. A decisive bubbling. Crit is nice. You're dead when we get our hue off, at least. Okay, that might change. It will not change. Because you did not push me at all. Thankfully. Um. Had to try for the kill. But you should die next round to our grave robber. Bit of bleed never hurt. Thank you for dodging. Thank you for not stressing, actually. That's a uh, bigger relief than the no dodge. And. Double kill more blood. Don't need it. Actually, you know, yeah, we'll take the blood. It's more valuable in the long run. Um, just unlock it then. Since it's already unlocked. And, yeah. Quest complete. The Sodden crew was defeated. We got Ancestor's Vintage, Delayed crave Curse Craving, plenty of money, and plenty of heirlooms once more get three, no, we get four level three heroes out of it. Um, you will only pray for stress relief. That's fine. That's meh. You got bad humors and thick blooded, which is more blight resist, but I think that was actually less blight resist funny enough. An exquisite example of craft Free armor upgrade. Uh, That's utility. potentially good. Um... Just go here, and everybody's already been unequipped. Ah, that's because I clicked on the level 1 mission it auto-clicked. Okay. Um, I think we'll probably do the courtyard again since we have plenty of level 3 heroes now. But first, we do have to get rid of some things, like his disease. Bye-bye bad humors. And her stress. Um, we should also unequip everybody real quick. And sort. There we go. Yeah, I gotta look up where this Crescendo box came from. Uh, can we upgrade your armory? We need five deeds for that. There. Just so it saves us a more expensive armor upgrade. Um... We're going to be taking you along, so go to Martyr's Flesh, because it's new. Alright, we still need 32 more for the Weaponsmithing Level 4 upgrade. And in here, we need 21 more paintings for that. Alright, that's not bad. But yeah, I think that this is going to be where I call the video. So, for now... I've been Solrak Dragon. I hope that you've enjoyed this one. If you have, leave me some feedback in the form of a like or a comment. If you guys want to check out more videos by me, be sure to check out my channel below. And if you like what you see, drop me a subscription. Outside of all that, I will see you all in the next video. Have a fantastic day, everybody.